Field Marshal Ernst Busch was a highly esteemed military leader whose remarkable career spanned both world wars. Known for his strategic brilliance, tactical expertise, and unwavering commitment to his troops, Bush played a significant role in shaping the outcomes of several crucial battles. His leadership qualities, dedication, and professionalism earned him the respect and admiration of both his comrades and adversaries alike. Born on July 6, 1885, in the city of Essen, Germany, Ernst Busch began his military journey at a young age. He enlisted in the Imperial German Army in 1904, where he quickly distinguished himself as a capable officer. His early service included participation in the First World War, during which he demonstrated his abilities as a dynamic and resourceful leader. After the war, Bush remained in the army, adapting to the rapid changes taking place in Germany. In 1933, he joined the newly formed Wehrmacht, the unified armed forces of Nazi Germany. Rising through the ranks, he played an instrumental role in the invasion of Poland in 1939, where his tactical acumen and ability to coordinate complex operations were on full display. Bush's success in Poland paved the way for further advancements in his military career. One of Bush's most significant contributions came during the crucial Battle of Moscow in 1941. As the commander of the 16th Army, his leadership skills and strategic foresight were instrumental in pushing deep into Soviet territory. Despite facing formidable resistance and harsh weather conditions, Bush's determination and ability to adapt to the challenges at hand played a vital role in the early successes of the German forces. His innovative use of combined arms tactics and operational flexibility earned him the respect of both his subordinates and superiors. Bush's military prowess was further exemplified during the Battle of Kursk in 1943. As the commander of Army Group Center, he successfully led his forces against the Soviet counteroffensive. Despite the eventual defeat of the German army in what became one of the largest tank battles in history, Bush's strategic planning and resolute command were instrumental in minimizing losses and preserving the fighting capacity of his units. Known for his hands-on approach and deep concern for the welfare of his troops, Bush maintained a close bond with his soldiers. He emphasized discipline, professionalism, and mutual respect, earning their loyalty and trust. By leading from the front, he inspired his men to overcome challenges and achieve remarkable feats on the battlefield. Throughout his career, Bush was recognized for his outstanding service and contributions to the German armed forces. He was awarded the Knight's Cross of the Iron Cross with oak leaves and swords, one of the highest military honors in Nazi Germany, for his exceptional leadership and strategic brilliance. After the war, Bush faced a series of challenges as he dealt with the consequences of his wartime service. He was held as a prisoner of war by the Soviet Union until 1955 and subsequently faced denazification proceedings. Despite these challenges, he remained resolute, never wavering in his commitment to the ideals of duty, honor, and service. Ernst Bush's military career stands as a testament to his extraordinary leadership and military prowess. His strategic brilliance, tactical innovations, and unwavering dedication to his troops make him a revered figure in military history. While his association with the Nazi regime raises ethical and moral questions, his military achievements cannot be denied. Bush's legacy serves as a reminder of the complexities and contradictions of war and the profound impact military leaders can have on the course of history. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more content like this, please consider subscribing to our channel. By subscribing, you'll be notified when we upload new videos. Thank you again for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in our next video.